circular is very, very clear. This is not a punitive law enforcement exercise. It is a preventive exercise. And this was planned as early as last year pa in response to public demand. Now every effort is going to be made to protect the identities of whoever will be um, um, be uh, identified in the test as, as related to, to drugs. So every effort will be made. Now, we are making sure of the confidentiality of documents. In case you have not heard, there is now a commission on privacy of information. Now, uh, if we, when we start the uh, project, the exercise, we will have a data manager who will have to be registered with the commission. Now, there are laws which penalize revealing of confidential information. Now, the information, in case you have not read the circular, states very clearly it will not be used in filing cases against a child or a teacher or a member of the deaf uh, family found to be uh, related to, to drugs. It will not be put on record. It's not going to be in the record of the student. So this has no relation at all, which I said to how many, how many press conferences ago since last year. It's not related to the enforcement side. We are on the preventive side. And so you will not even know the school. And we are not going to have a press conference. The test will not be done under your eye and you will not, you will not be interviewing the persons, etc., etc. The press will not be uh, involved here. Everything is going to be confidential. Now, if there is a finding, it will have to be reconfirmed. It's not just going to be after one test, tapos na. No, it will have to be uh, reconfirmed. And then, depending on the severity of the affliction of the child, then he can be uh, referred to a guidance counselor or a doctor. But definitely the parents will be involved. If there will be a leakage, it will be probably from other sectors, not from us. Never, never, never from us. Because we have very strict penalties for release of confidential information.